Hello everybody at Escape Arts, it's Kate Fleetwood here, um, your very proud patron and I want to just say hello and uh, not only say um, let's hope soon this will all be over um, but just to say congratulations for all the work you have been managing to do and maybe that's created some new ways of working. This is certainly a new way of working for me so I thought I'd See my message from my my little studio which I made um, when Covid struck last year because I do voiceovers sometimes and uh, and I and I got lots of this foam stuff and I stapled lots of duvets to the wall and I got a microphone and all sorts of things and I'm a bit of a Luddite so that was a bit of a baptism of fire trying to work out the software um, but um, yeah I've had to sort of adapt a lot and uh, but I know you guys have and I know that these staff and everybody at Escape Arts have done an incredible job on trying to keep the cohesion of your community together either digitally or uh, just in the, the the projects you're managing to create and keep going is it's extraordinary and I just want to say well done and thank you for doing that and um, from your uh, creator leadership programs, which I believe are going brilliantly well, for the employment programs, for the apprenticeship programs, it's something I I know very much in my heart. The people I feel really strongly need support are emerging and young artists who are developing their skills. I was very lucky; I didn't have to go through a pandemic in my early career, and I could start to establish myself and my relationships um, with artists and um, people who could give me a job so I really you know having this kind of support is is invaluable absolutely invaluable and I I know how much we all miss each other we miss working together we miss collaborating we miss the magic of um, unprescribed things happening in rehearsal rooms and where those ideas may take you in the collaboration that is as an art for an artist is is absolutely imperative so thank you to everybody at Escape Arts who've been managing to keep that going for your participants. Amazing things that I've, I've looked, that beautiful freedom video, it was so touching and poignant and, and funny and um, yes, uh, I, I just thought it was wonderful, thank you. And the, um, the garden arts and the cookery and all those brilliantly creative things, we've all had to just open up our minds really to the possibility of what we can achieve and I think what Escape Arts is doing and continues to do for the future of not only the program but the future of the participants to stay mentally strong and resilient in our communities through art so that when this is all over there's there st still exists it's so important and I just want to say a big big thank you um, to all the employees all the trustees, all the staff and the stakeholders of who there are so many I could mention, but I know um, you're all as important as one another, so I wouldn't want to miss anyone out. But um, thank you for your continued support. And um, yeah, it's about staying connected, isn't it? And I know that's what I miss the most is being in a room with people making something. And we will. We'll do it again. But I just want to say that I'm very proud to be your patron and um, I hope I can come up to Stratford soon and see you all and see my mum and dad. Um, and I just thank you. And it's all about the future and keeping those channels open and keeping our mental health stable and allowing us to fall and stand up again and fail and start again. And I know with all the support from everybody at the Escape Arts that the um, beneficiaries of your talent and support and dedication and care um, will continue to grow just like those gardens. Bye. <laughs> much love, much love. And stay safe, everybody. Get the vaccination when you can. And um, here's to a, a better new year for us all. Gotta learn how to press stop.